Uh, it was a phenomenal pool of tryouts, really talented, energetic, positive energy. People brought a lot of joy, a lot of skill to the field. Um, we had 120 at open and we had uh, 72 here at close today and whittling that down to a final roster of about 30 is going to be really challenging because a lot of people brought a, a lot of really amazing things. Super impressed and super happy. Good problem to have. Can be, right? so. Yeah, I mean we definitely think that we've got the talent to win the championship this year. That'll be one of the goals um, and we want to make sure we do it in the right ways, right? Bringing a lot of joy on the field, supporting each other, staying positive. Um, so we think all those things will come together and we got a chance to win the title, but there's definitely some really good teams around the country, so it's going to be a good battle. Yeah, I mean, like on the field, uh, we want to build a lot of chemistry offensively. You know, we want to get everybody on the same page and start to build up that, like, I know where this person's going to go in this situation, in this space. Um, and then defensively, we really put a premium on team defense and chemistry as well. We run some reasonably advanced schemes relative to what, um, you know, we like to do defensively. And we want to make sure everybody has a good firm understanding of how to operate within our defensive schemes. And, that, and then they can also like kind of start to rule break and, and use their own skill sets more actively, you know, to get blocks, secure Ds, play shut down D, all those things. But the goal is to build a cohesive unit that can do all those things together, right? No one or two people are going to carry us. Don't have a good answer. We've got seven players from last year. Well, six players from last year that are signed and one new player that's already signed. So right now the roster is seven. Um, and like I said, we've got 72 guys out here and we're going to fill out the other 23 players from that pool. There's quite a few returners in that pool and we certainly know those players very well, but we're going to fill out the roster with the folks that we think embody Colorado Ultimate and, you know, can, can bring it for the summit out of this group and returners may be a part of it, may well. Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, I think a big goal of ours is to make sure that folks feel like they have a good opportunity to play high level ultimate. Um, whether or not they've already played elite college or club somewhere that like they get to come out here and showcase their skills So there's quite a few guys that I thought came out here that didn't necessarily have like a really super elite resume uh, That came out here and, and played super super well um, Just thinking off the top of my head. I think Theo Watkins threw some really impressive flick hucks um, Saw some great defense from a lot of different guys You know, it's hard to pick out just a handful of names because I could probably go through every single person out here and, and list something that well that they did but the goal is um, to make sure that everybody is, is getting an opportunity to showcase what they can do. Uh, and we feel like, you know, went really well for that today. Um, I mean, I think it, you know, out of the gates last year, there was a lot of folks that were new to AUDL. So it took us a little while to kind of find our stride. And then we had a lot of players that were in their college season that didn't join the team until after the end of college nationals. And so then integrating them was a bit of a process. This year, we have way better sense of like what the early season looks like, what the AUDL, like the differences in the AUDL game look like. So really confident that going into the games, you know, we're going to be more prepared this year from the start of the season. But we've got a really awesome schedule, right? We're playing, um, we're playing New York, we're playing Minnesota, both phenomenal teams from outside our division. We're super excited about those games. And we know, you know, the Southwest teams, uh, SoCal, uh, LA, and, and San Diego got really good rosters. So does Portland. So it's, it's going to be really fun. We're just excited to get out there and compete. New York, no question. I mean, they're a couple undefeated seasons in a row. And uh, yeah, they are the favorites and they're a super talented team, super well coached. So they're definitely the ones we're keeping an eye on.